Much like seeing a fish out of water, you may be wondering how the coaster got to Campo. I definitely watched that coaster go up and down the coast. Absolutely, you would have seen it probably every day. This locomotive pulled coaster commuter trains between San Diego and Oceanside for 26 years. After chugging more than a million miles, Coaster 2103 should have been cut up into scrap metal. I would have been devastated, really. Instead, Stephen Hager, president of the Pacific Southwest Railway Museum, one of the best jobs in the world, offered her a new home. You can't pass up a chance to acquire such a significant piece of equipment like this. But how do you move a 280,000 pound locomotive without train tracks? The answer, carefully and in the middle of the night. How come? Highway Patrol will only let you make a move like this at night when there's not traffic on the road. If you do the math for the travel time, the average speed was about three to four miles per hour. <laughs> wow. Last August in National City. I was afraid it wouldn't lift in one piece. The locomotive was loaded onto a trailer. We had a lot of people who saw this and uh, were out there with their phones taking pictures. The 72-mile trip to Campo took them a week and was followed by a big bill. The locomotive was donated free of charge to us, but moving it here cost us about $140,000. I was ecstatic to get it here. If you haven't noticed... Well, it's a climb up here. <laughs> it's like Jack and the Beanstalk. Stephen adores trains. You have to be when you're volunteering at a museum like this. Despite dozens of switches, he says they're fairly simple to drive. So you push it that way to go forward, pull it back that way to go in reverse. And now that she's here, Stephen just asks that you come and take a ride. An adult can come out and take a ride for 18 bucks. Right. That's affordable. Exactly. We're very affordable, and it's even cheaper for children. All aboard a piece of San Diego history. It's at its new home now, Campo, California. Woo! Woo! In the Zevely Zone. Woo! Jeff Zevely, CBS 8.